In this webcast, we're going to break down the mechanism of nucleophilic acyl substitution followed by addition. Now let's take a look at the substitution addition mechanism for Grignard nucleophiles. When this ester is treated with two equivalents of methyl magnesium bromide, it can be converted into the tertiary alcohol shown here. The process by which this takes place is first nucleophilic attack by the Grignard reagent to the carbonyl carbon. This kicks up a lone pair of electrons to create this tetrahedral intermediate shown here. Beta elimination occurs in this intermediate because it has a good leaving group in the phenoxide anion. Therefore the lone pair of electrons flow back down to create the carbonyl again and kick out the phenoxide leaving group. This creates a new ketone species that can be attacked by a second equivalent of Grignard reagent to create a new tetrahedral intermediate shown here. Now this intermediate doesn't have a good leaving group that can facilitate beta elimination. Therefore simple protonation then occurs to convert it to the tertiary alcohol. Now let's take a look at how this same ester can be converted into a primary alcohol when treated with lithium aluminum hydride. This process takes place by the same substitution addition mechanism that we've seen previously, wherein lithium aluminum hydride is a source of nucleophilic hydride species that can attack the carbonyl carbon in an ADN step the same way we previously had learned. This attacks the carbonyl carbon and kicks up a lone pair of electrons to create a new tetrahedral intermediate. Now beta elimination is facilitated in this intermediate because of the good leaving group of the phenoxide anion. Therefore the lone pair electrons flow down to create the new carbonyl again and kick out the phenoxide leaving group. Now this creates a new aldehyde species that can be attacked by a second equivalent of hydride in an ADN step to kick up the lone pair of electrons again to create a new tetrahedral intermediate. Now in this intermediate there are no good leaving groups to facilitate beta elimination, therefore again, simple protonation then occurs. This creates our primary alcohol shown here. You should be able to pick up the pattern of the elementary steps contained within the substitution addition mechanism. These elementary steps will show up time and time again in the reactions of carbonyl-containing molecules.